Hey, I was just thinking like it's almost spring break and like how nice would it be just to have my own little fort that I can just read in and seclude myself. So I'm gonna do it. <laughs> so originally I was just gonna like make a blanket fort or something, but then I did more thinking and I was like, what would be something where like I could have like a little something that I could actually get in and it's like secluded and it's like compact enough where I can like lay in there and stuff. And then it came to me. Why don't I go on Amazon and I'll buy like a little tent and I'll get in there and read. So believe it or not, for this video I actually invested some money so make sure to subscribe. But for like $25 on Amazon, I found this weird tent thing that's made for like children. And I was looking at the pictures and videos and stuff because I wasn't actually sure about the dimensions. But from what I can tell, several children plus a full-sized adult can fit in there. Unless they're just scamming me, which I desperately hope is not the case. And I don't believe it comes with any instructions for setup, so, um, frick. Um, but also, I thought it'd be really cool to get some, like, nice Christmas lights. Oh, I just smacked my dog in the face. I'm so sorry. I also thought that it would be a good idea to get some Christmas lights and, like, drape it over, like, on top. So then when you're inside the tent, there's, like, little lights everywhere. I don't know. I thought that'd be cool. I don't know if it's actually gonna work out. And then I'm gonna just put a ton of blankets and a ton of pillows in there, and it's just gonna be a little space for me to live in. So I'm assuming that the tent is big enough for me to, like, lay down in, which I don't know what, because it's made for children, that's why I'm concerned. This might be boring, but I mean, my dreams are just coming true. If you're wondering the brand that I paid an absurd amount of money for, this is it. And I was looking around, this was like 25 bucks. I like felt kind of ripped off, but also like kind of happy because like, it's the Ford. Here she is, y'all. The big reveal. That was so exciting. Looking at this right now, it looks very small. I really hope I can fit in this. <laughs> if not, I'm gonna put the word fail in the title. <laughs> My favorite thing is clickbait titles, like all lowercase or like adding the word emotional gets me every time. Like I die laughing. I feel like it's kind of rude, but it's so funny to me. Anyways, let's do it. Does it come with directions? Do they expect me to be able to do this all by myself? Oh, the instructions come attached to the bag. That's great. The literal instructions just say like, do it. <laughs> it says to lay the tent flat and then you get the wires and you just weave them across, I think, and then tie the bow on top. And they think I'm capable of doing that. <laughs> so I'm gonna do it like that. That doesn't seem as big as I had thought. It's fine. Then it says to get the wires. Whoa, this is a big wire. Okay, okay, okay. And it says to weave it. How do I weave it? How does one weave it? Where does this go? Wait a second. Uh-oh. Everything's falling apart. So you stick this in here. How do you do that though? Oh, oh, oh. I think I got it. Maybe not. <gasps> What the heck? Uh... I'm sweating, and I haven't even done anything yet. <laughs> Is this entertaining to watch? Y'all like to watch me suffer? Maybe I need to refer back to the instructions. Literally, the instructions just say, insert the poles. Then, then you're done. <laughs> That's literally what it says. But I can't even insert the poles. Pole number one has been inserted. At least I think that's what ha just happened. Now we're gonna insert pole number two. Lucky me though, is I don't have a child here to witness my struggles. Like if there is a child right here being like, Dad, what are you doing? Why are you doing? <laughs> like that would just really top this off, right? And from what I can tell, this tent isn't even big enough for me to get inside of. <laughs> Ooh, what is going on? Is this my tent? Wait, what? This doesn't look so right. Mother, oh my gosh, how do I do this? I'm about to start crying. Look at this tent right now. <laughs> this tent looks how I feel. Doesn't it look just like the picture? I feel like in other videos I've done, it's like a joke that I suck at everything, but like, what the frick is this? Okay, so all of the poles just came out. <sighs> I feel like over the years, there have been very few videos that have broken me down to my core. And this video is that video. I'm honestly probably gonna have to cut the camera just so I can start like crying, honestly. I remember I was starting this video and I was like, it's gonna be so easy. I'm gonna give myself an easy video this week. 
Well, it turns out karma got its kiss for me, you know what I'm saying? Wait, why are these poles so long? I can't even move without just smacking and everything in my house. Oh! <gasps> wait, 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 wait. I think I get it now. Where'd the pole go? Oh! Right when I think I got it, it all just falls apart. You've given me a million reasons to let you go. I think this goes up. Oh, wow. Okay, it looks like something's happening right now. I mean, it looks like it's standing, but what is up with this pole? Oh! I'm cutting the camera. Okay, so it's literally been an hour. <laughs> I finally reached a point where I know what I'm doing. So, I got this part to stand up. Now I just gotta put the other, the other pull in. Maybe I'm just an idiot, or maybe this is just freaking hard. I don't know, but I'm sweating, I'm frustrated. Maybe I took a 10 minute break just to clear my head. Wait, 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 wait. Is this it? Is this the moment? Oh my gosh! Is this the moment? <laughs> is this it? <gasps> I did it! <laughs> I did it! I did it! I'd like to thank not only God, but Jesus. I'm not joking or like trying to be dramatic when I say that it's been like an hour. I just feel like I, I saw Jesus so many times during that. And I just want to thank you for watching with me and believing in me. Even though most of you probably clicked off at this point. But I still appreciate the ones who decided to stay. So now I have these cool fairy lights. Are they called fairy lights? I feel like I've heard people on the internet say that before. And now I'm gonna weave these over the top so it's all whatever, you know? I thought this was supposed to be a comforting, like nice, fun activity, but I wanna rip my hair out, you know what I'm saying? I mean, looking at it from the outside, it looks pretty butt, but I mean, it's fine. Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree. I wanna rip my hair out. Y'all remember last March when I shaved my head? LOL, never again, if you know what I'm saying. That was probably the worst decision of my life. All right, so now, <laughs> whoa, this looks like a mess. Even though I had a panic attack several different times while trying to set this up, at least now I have like something to show for my work, you know? I feel like maybe it's a cool idea to put some blankets over the top. Uh-oh, wait, is that a fire hazard for the lights? Eh, I'll just leave it. Okay, my dog is here. Uh oh. Please leave a nice review. Do you like it? I made it just for you. Except don't touch it at all. Ever. I mean I didn't make it for you but you can go in there if you would like. Probably get trapped and then knock it over and I will cry but. Oh, it's like a cute little fort for him. You want to get in there honey? Actually I don't trust you. No offense. I love you so much but you're gonna knock it over and I will cry. I know that everybody thinks I hate you because I scream at you in my videos, but I love you a lot. I just don't like when the squeaky toy is going through my view, but I love you anyway. Wally is nine months old now. He's living his best life. He weighs 75 pounds. I know some of you have been desperately wanting an update. He's a big fat blonde boy, if you know what I'm saying. Uh-oh, uh-oh, is it hump time? I thought hump o'clock was later, uh-oh. <laughs> what the freak, oh no, oh no, oh no. Well, can you um, uh, get the freak out? <laughs> I'm trying to introduce the people to my house. I'm trying to do one of those cool booktube things where I'm like, here's my room, and it cuts to a montage with cool music, okay? Welcome to the room, come on in. Oh no, he ruined everything. Get away. <laughs> Did you just trip over my foot? <laughs> Wally, I love you so much, but what the frick is this? This doesn't look quite as cool as I had expected it to look. <laughs> so here it is. Um, this is the space. Um, it doesn't look as cool, but you know what? It's fine. I don't care. I don't care that it's been 45 minutes of me trying to build this and 45 minutes of me trying to scream at my dog to move out of the way. I don't care. This is like a zombie movie. He is on the outside of this tent. He's shoving his snoot trying to get in. All ready for the big reveal. Here's my book that I was gonna read in here. Whatever, um, and then here's where I was gonna sit. I'm sure I could fit like maybe two people in here. I can get like really tight in this corner like this and read my book. I don't mind and then I think two people could probably fit over there. Am I crazy for thinking this looks really pretty? You know like the little lights above like it's like a starry night. This video turned out a lot sadder than I had expected it to. I thought it was gonna be like a fun jokey video but it just came into like a sad like ooh poor kid you know. I mean I'm fine. I'm not bitter. I mean just a little bit at everybody ever but. Now I figured I could do some reading in here. It's definitely not tight at all. It's definitely really cozy. 
And I'm gonna read now because that was the point of this, so let's go. Chapter 28. Aelin Gil and Athanius didn't bother to contain her smoogness as Rolfi pointed to the large table on the right side of his oil face. I feel like this is a good time to tell you I'm illiterate. <laughs> if you're wondering what my um, preemptive review for Empire of Storms is, I don't know who any of these people are and I am bored. I mean, if you want to stop on by to my cool kid fort, definitely show up. But if you want to come over, I will recommend bringing like a tank top and shorts because I feel like I'm having a stroke. Can y'all see the sweat that's starting to build on my face? If you don't like dogs, I don't recommend to come because I mean, right outside this way, we just got a puppy still. Oh. Oh, Wally, well, you look really cute right now, bud. You can come in if you want. Wally, well, come here. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh no. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Friends who build forts together stay together, you know what I'm saying? Just two boys in a fort together. Wally, are you hot? I know that you're like hot, but like are you sweating up a storm in here? So yeah, I guess this turned out a lot different than I had expected it to <laughs> for um, several different reasons, obviously. I feel like if it was like one of those colder summer nights, this would be fun to like set up outside and like read and put these lights on. I feel like that'd be really pretty, but if you want to do it in your house in the dead of winter, it's probably not the best idea. And also, if you bring a dog in here that weighs, what are you doing? Are you looking in your butthole right now? I'm trying to outro the video, dude. Nasty, that's all I gotta say. That. What do you have to say for yourself for doing that? Ooh. I do think that this could be like a really fun thing to like have like a reading party with your friends. But I feel like this would be a better idea if you had like a larger tent and it was the summer so you could actually be outside and you could like hang out and read together and you know just chat and have a bunch of blankets and pillows everywhere and hang out. But that is it for this video. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to my channel because I post videos on Tuesday. I am pre-filming this video just because I have like spring break and stuff coming up but I hope you have a fun spring break. I hope you, you know, have a good time unless you're like one of those people that's like spring break. <laughs> then I mean live your life but be safe I guess. Are you leaving? Are you leaving? Did you just slap that light? Good boy. I like when you pet his head because like, he literally like drifts off to another dimension. Wally, you want to say bye to all the people? Bye. 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 People want me to show more of him, but he's a puppy right now, so all he does is jump on you and try to hump you, and I just feel like that would be embarrassing stuff to post. It is so hot in there, and I just came out, and it, <laughs> it seriously feels like 10 degrees cooler. Ew. Uh-oh. He's trying to hunt me. <laughs> ah!